I believe, I believe we, are, we, are, we are going to a, a higher level, yeah. but uh, with, the, with the quality we have in the team, we have been together for three years, so I believe uh, we'll be ready when the time comes to go and face the team in Djibouti. Yeah. The impact of coach Robert Matana, you know he left and came back, what has been the overall impact? Uh, I believe um, what, what he brought into the team is a winning mentality, because he is a winner. Yeah. For him, he doesn't he doesn't really care how about how we play, but the result. He's always uh, going for results, and it's always a win. So he has uh, instilled that winning mentality in the squad. Yeah. Captain, what what what, what do you have for, for your closest opponent, KCB? Uh, KCB is a, is a good team with a good coach, quality players. They gave us a good run if, a good run for our money. They pushed us till the end, and also they had a good season. Yeah. Asike, what do you feel that June that year moment when you were given a, the ticket for the CAF uh, Champions League, but now you have justified it that uh, you deserve the ticket in the title? How do you feel? Uh, we, 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 we had a talk as a group and, uh, and uh, we were motivated to, to leave the trophy because we believe there was something that missing. As, as much as we were going to represent the country, there was, that, there was that medal, there was that trophy which was missing in the cabinet. And that's what motivated us to keep on pushing till the end. Maybe what can you say about uh, also Coach Robert Matana? I heard you talk about the winning mentality, but uh, also being a coach who has won it for the first time, as a three times as a coach in the, in the, in the East Kenyan history. Um, the coach, as I can say, uh, is a winner. Uh, if, you, if you look at his record, all over he has been in every club, he has, he has won a title. So once he stepped into the changing room, the mentality of the players changed and it really helped us to know that this is a winning team. And, uh, and if you don't win, a, we, we don't win a silverware. That, that then it will be a disappointment. As a, yeah. You must be having a message to the fans who have not been coming to the stadium because of coronavirus. Yeah. And now you have won it, even with a few of them who came today. Um, of course, uh, football without the fans is not football. But I mean, there was a pandemic, and we had to adjust. We have to understand the situation that we are in. So. We have missed them, but uh, the, for the few fans who showed up today, we said thank you. They gave they gave us that extra push, and uh, we look forward to seeing them next season. The last one from me: you are getting to the Champions League uh, shortly after the league, not like the usual other seasons. Yeah. What do you think is going to give the change in there in terms of how you play your first matches there? Um. Yeah, of course. Uh, I mean, we are going to have a short break. We rest, we recharge the batteries, and then we go again. But I believe. Uh, uh, the technical bench will have their work cut out and we'll, 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 when we resume for training we'll be good to go and face uh, the teams in the Champions League. Yeah, we don't have a long time to, to say we're going to rest for long, no. We need to recover, get back and get back to business. Yeah. Congrats on all the best. Thank you. Thank you. Enjoy the moment. Thank you. Remember to subscribe, comment, share Skills TV.